lovely people. Good morning. So today I wanted to take you along for just a cozy day of homemaking. Let's romanticize all of the annoying little tasks that we have to do to keep our home going. So first there's a couple of things cleaning wise that I have to do. Uh, I need to clean the bathroom which I don't like doing. Well honestly I don't really mind cleaning the bathroom. I mostly just really don't like cleaning the shower because it's so much work. <laughs> But then I have a couple of things that I'm actually really looking forward to doing to kind of treat myself, I guess. <laughs> so I still have a letter from my pen pal that I would like to read and to answer. So that's something that's really nice and cozy and fun to do. So I think I'll do that with a nice cup of tea or a nice fall themed coffee. And then I also actually have some, I think it's called quince in English. In Dutch, it's kweeperen. I'm not sure. There's a spider coming down, like in the middle of the living room. It's a big spider too. Okay, so then I got some quince from my parents-in-law. So yesterday I actually went to make quince chutney with my mother-in-law. It was so much fun. I really loved doing that. But I did take a few quince home. Quince? Quinces? Like, I did take a few of them home and my father-in-law just told me a really easy little recipe, I guess, way of preparing them. So I think I'm going to try that today as well, which will be fun. We like, it'll be a nice seasonal little dish to try. So, Without further ado, uh, let's get productive and let's start the cleaning of the bathroom first so I can get that out of the way.
matcha ready it is time to do a little bit of editing by now i'm actually pretty hungry so i decided to make myself some lunch before going on with all of the tasks of today my bean salad as a starter and then some toast with hummus and I'm going to put some lettuce on top of that so I am going to eat this now and I will see you in a bit mm. it's so good
guys, I am back in the kitchen. So yesterday I made quince chutney with my mother-in-law, which was so much fun. That's going to be a really fun memory to look back on. Lots of chopping, lots of peeling, lots of work, but it was really fun to do that together. And it made the whole house smell so, so good. I don't have it here to show you because the jars were way too hot when I went home. And also it has to sit like a month before we can really eat it, before it's really ready. So I will show that once we've moved in to our new apartment. And she gave me two quinces, quince? How do you say that? <laughs> I have no idea. She gave me some home and then my father-in-law actually told me how I could prepare these like in a really easy but delicious way. So I thought I would try that right now so we could have it as like a little bit of a dessert with dinner. Let's see if I can prepare these quinces <laughs> um, and make something delicious out of them. After yesterday I got so much practice <laughs> so I think I am much much better now than I used to be Yeah, 
that's good. They're pretty sour actually. So I'm going to do a little bit more editing so I am going to leave you here for today I hope it was fun for you to kind of come along in a bit of a day of homemaking as well as just enjoying some little fall bits <laughs> I felt like it was a pretty nice productive but also really quite fun a day so perfect balance for me I highly recommend you try those quince if you can get your hands on them they are kind of sour, but also really quite good. <laughs> so it's definitely a nice full taste. I think it would also be really good if you'd add a little bit of cinnamon. So if you enjoyed this, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, which would really truly help me out. Maybe leave a comment to say hi. These are definitely the best ways that you can support my channel. I wish you a lovely rest of your day and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Thank mm -hmm. you.